Zachary Blair. Um, Patty, I just want to say that no one respected you more than I did. Um, to be fair. Okay, you got to direct your comments to the commission. I will. To be fair, I waited four and a half years for the truth to come out, what I was told, and it never happened. And my whole life changed. I spent four and a half years going through these records. I quit my job to do this full time and to dedicate my time to the survivors. So you're not the only one who's affected by this, and I think that's something that you need to acknowledge when you address me directly. Um, second, um, you said the city didn't know about the violations, but all of these records show that the city did know. On the night of the shooting, the day of the shooting, Fire Marshal Tammy Hughes texted that there were violations inside of Pulse. So the city released a statement yesterday saying there were no violations at Pulse. That's different than we didn't know about the violations at Pulse. That's why we say there's a cover-up, because you keep saying they weren't there. That's not saying that, they, that, you, that you didn't know about them. It's two different things. So you are covering it up, because there's records showing that there were violations at Pulse. And then you're affecting the current premise liability case by saying that there are no violations at Pulse. Again, the million dollars you're going to give to the Palmas, that's going to fund the case. The premise liability case is going to fund their defense against victims. So you're giving money against the victims to work against the victims while you're saying that you're there to support the victims. No one's even listening <laughs> but you. You know, it's, it's, um, it's, it's heartbreaking to see this happen. I don't want to be here. I didn't want to do this. None of us want to be here and do this. It's a screen right here where we can see. Okay. Well, none of us want to. Thank you. None of us want to be here and do this. And, and I don't want to be here. I, I shake, I, and, but I'm call, being called a liar and untrustworthy. I've been nothing but trustworthy and telling the truth. And, and I have all the records to show it, you know? And, that's, and I'm going to keep putting them online because that's what I've been doing for four and a half years. And it's, it's wrong that the city's releasing statements saying that there were no issues at Pulse when we know that's not the truth. And the survivors can tell you the stories who were in the freaking building that that's not the truth. That's all. Yes. Madam Clerk. Up next is Keenan Carter, followed by Tara Parker, and then Barbara Fraser. 